may come forward, General. Long live the king. You request for an audience, and it was important. Yes, Your Majesty. Well, what is it? Your Majesty, you are Jabin, the great and powerful king of Canaan that reigneth in Hazor. You are mighty. Your word and your wisdom spread far and wide. And the... Yes, 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 yes. I already know those things. Just tell me what you want and be done with it. O king, I am Sisera, general of all thy hosts of soldiers. I am well acquainted with the comings and goings of the Israelite people who have invaded our land. And I... No, come I... to the point. Uh, Israel wins battles when their God is pleased with them. When they disobey their God and he is angry, they lose battles. Your Majesty, at the present time, all in Israel are doing evil in the sight of their God. Oh, and so you think it is the proper time to attack them? Yes, Your Majesty. You're right, General. Absolutely right. Prepare the army. We will make a surprise attack on Israel as soon as you are ready. Oh, we've done it, Your Majesty. We've defeated the Israelites. They are now subject to your wise rule. <laughs> oh, I'll make slaves out of them. Exact a high tribute. <laughs> Long live the king. General, I sent for you because we face a serious situation. Relative to the Israelites, your majesty. Yes, it's exactly what I mean. Oh, I doubt if it can be as serious as you think, your majesty. They have served us now for 20 years, and I doubt if they will even try to free themselves after so long a time. But they are. That's just it. And a woman is doing it. Oh, oh. A woman, Your Majesty? Yes. She is supposed to be a prophet of the Israelite God. Her name is Deborah. At any rate, she and a soldier by name Barak have gotten together 10,000 armed men to do battle against us. <laughs> you are worried, Your Majesty, over 10,000 soldiers. No. But the Israelites again worship and obey their God, which means that he will work for them. Perform miracles, if necessary. These things are sure, Your Majesty. They come directly from Heber. Heber said at this very minute, the prophetess Deborah, together with Barak, is at Mount Tabor with 10,000 soldiers of Naphtali and Zebulon. Your orders, Your Majesty. Get together all our chariots of iron. Ha, <laughs> ha, ha. No foot soldier can survive against chariots of iron. How many do we have now, General? Mm, about 900, Your Majesty. Get them ready, and the army. We march to Mount Tabor tomorrow. Yes, Your Majesty. Still, if I may say so, sire, I doubt if we need worry very much with a woman at the head of the enemy army. <laughs> <laughs> Today is the day in which the Lord will deliver General Sisera and his army into our hands. Get thee up, lead the army down from the mountain, and battle the army of Sisera. Sisera, King Jabin's general, will escape, but he shall be delivered into the hand of a woman. Well, what do you think, driver? The battle is lost, sir. Oh, just what I think. I think I'm going to get off this chariot and try to escape on foot. If I were you, I'd do the same. I'm sure this is the place. Who is it? Sisera. Sisera? Yes, I'm general of King Jabin's army. What are you doing here? Is not there peace between thy house and King Jabin? Yes. Well, our army has just been defeated by the Israelite army, and I, I, I want a safe place to hide. I'll be right out. You escaped from the fighting? Yes. When I saw that we had no chance against the Israelites, I fled. Come in, my lord, and fear not, for we're at peace with thy king. You're very kind. But I'm, I'm thirsty, so give me, I pray thee, a little water to drink. I'll do better than that, my lord. Here's some milk. Drink thy fill. 
Oh, thank you. It's very refreshing. Perhaps you'd better hide if the Israelite army is pursuing you. They are. Then lie down here. Uh, That's it. Now I'll keep you covered with this mantle. I wonder if you'd stand in the doorway. And if anyone comes to inquire, tell them that there is no one here. I, ooh, I, I think I'll go to sleep. I'm terribly weary. There, now. Rest at ease, my lord, and sleep. I shall see that no man disturbs you. <sighs> ah, at last he's asleep. Now to give him what he deserves. Let's see if I... Oh, here's a long nail. And this hammer, just what I want. <laughs> oh, here comes someone now. I hope it's one of the Israelite soldiers. And I'll run out to meet him. There he is, Barak, sir. Sisera, general of King Jabin's army. The Lord has delivered him into my hands, and he died the death of a traitor and coward. God has this day caused Israel to prevail against Jabin, king of Canaan. <laughs> 